Of course, in testing, there are always what ifs. You might ask, right now I have a very small and lightweight CT connected to this. It saturates almost immediately. So what if I wanted to do a ratio on this? I just selected ratio and I selected hot one. The normal target is 0.1 volts, but this won't make 0.1 volts per turn without being deeply saturated. So what will the test set do? The test set now prints the total harmonic distortion down here. It says THD error. That is caused by either saturation or remnants, so it won't go any further. It will just display stop there and save that. The result at the lower level of excitation as the, as the ratio result. Okay, what if the output is shorted? Right now I have both leads on the same terminal, so I press hot one. And I'm trying to do an automatic test with the lead shorted. and it has detected the overcurrent and tripped. Now in order to recover, I go back to the menu and start over. Remove the, remove the short. Try it again here. Okay, once again, it has flagged the THD error on the bottom down here, and uh, it has stopped the ramp and gives you the best ratio it could, and it's now saving that. Okay, another what if is if, what if the CT is not connected? It doesn't have a ratio in, or the, the leads are not actually connected to the CT, and I press hot one. What happens then? Ramping up the volts out. Okay, it gives you, it says key menu to clear fault, it says ratio error, it was not getting a ratio in range, so it flagged that, and uh, that's the what if the CT is actually not connected. Thank you for watching.